Hi team, welcome back to the Dossary channel. My name is Shuraz Thelang. We are going to see about the web application. How to create the web app. So, first of all, I would like to show you my PPT here. Dops Ridge. This is my channel. So, today we are going to see about this. So, I am doing the slideshow. See, Azure App Services. Azure Web Apps, parts of the Azure App Services, is a fully managed platform for building, deploying, and scaling web applications. Oh, if we see overall of the web apps, so Azure Web Apps provide a flexible and powerful platform for hosting and managing web applications, allowing you to focus on building great applications without worrying about the underlying infrastructure. So, if we need to deploy anything, then we need to create web, app web apps. Suppose there is a web application, for example, suppose there is a .NET calculator web application then we need to create web apps to deploy that calculator app right so we'll go and see some common uses of the web app so it's a web application hosting just i told you already if there is a .NET, java node.js python PHP and Ruby programming languages like a application returns in such as programming languages then it provides a scalable and reliable hosting platform for your applications again it uses it use for continuous deployment Azure web apps integrates seamlessly with popular source control systems like github azure devs and bitbucket this allows for continuous deployment for your applications making it easy to update your applications whenever you push changes to your repository so that time it updates like uh, it easy to update applications whenever you push changes to your repository then scalability azure web apps enables you to scale your applications horizontally by adding more instances or vertically by upgrading the hardware resources allocated to your app service plan this ensures that your applications can handle varying levels of traffic efficiency then automating scale automatic scaling high availability security integration with azure services dev test environments azure web apps can be used to quickly spin up development and testing environments for your application you can create multiple development slots for staging testing and production making it easy to test changes before deploying them to production like these are the some important common uses for web application so thank you so much this was my ppt please like comment share and subscribe my channel so we'll go and see practically so now we need azure cloud account to create the web app web app using azure app services then so let's go we'll see we'll go to the azure cloud i have already logged in here into the azure cloud so first of all always we need to create a resource group so click on create 
then this is my pay as you go account so you can use free trial account also I have like already used free trial account hence I am using this pay as you go so let's go you can give any name here already I had given there new research new RG so we can use that no issue you can take any name here then I'm going to select Central India you can choose here any location sorry any region next if you want to give name then it's okay if you don't want to give name then even it's okay next then click on create yes resource group is created then now we'll go to the app services you need to put here app services see now click on create web app so we'll see in future static web app web app plus database wordpress on app service so today we are going to see about web app so click on this then we need to choose the resource group if you don't have created already resource group then you can create from here also but we have created it so select this then for this web app you can provide any name so I am giving here only web app so it's not available hence this red color error is showing here so we can take new something you cannot give space web web app for container so this is also not available so this is available so go ahead publish code we are keeping here publish code now runtime stack while working on real-time project our live project I'll show you here or in any example of project I'll show you here why we need to choose like suppose I'm choosing dotnet 6 LTS if there is a project of dotnet then if it is depend on the 6 then we can choose this then now I'm choosing Linux operating system you can choose Windows also then region you can choose anything like any region I'm taking here Central India so Linux plan came here like ASP new RG it six to eight it's by default this is the pricing plan after clicking on the explore pricing plans it is going all things so you can go and check here for the pricing plans now we need to click on next and if you want to click its a database then you can click on this but now this is not on the database sorry on the database so click on next it's deployment so continuous deployment it's disable if continuous deployments want to enable then you can click here then git actions details also you can see here click next enable public access on enable network injection off monitoring if your 
clicking on no then enable application insight no means you will save the charges if you are clicking on yes then we need to pay extra charges for monitoring purpose so click on no and go do next and again you can give here any name or if you are keeping blank it's okay click on next then review and create click on create then web application is going to be sorry web app is going to be created so you can go here and see submitting deployment so as like this you can create web app using apps azure app services so you can go here click or go to services even you can click here and app services if you are putting app services then even from here you can go into the resources now go to the resource see this is the web app which we have created you can copy this default domain you got the default domain copy this and go to the new web browser and paste here and enter if your web app is running and waiting for your content if you are getting this message it mean your web app is working fine so as like this we can create web app so tomorrow we will see new service new compute service in app services so today this much was available with me thank you so much friends please like comment share and subscribe my channel thank you so much bye bye